I went, I went into the store and I was buying some groceries and one of the ladies in there who I know very well, everybody knows us very well in there, she came out and said, aren't you with Buddy today? And I said, of course I am. I'm always with Buddy. She says, well, he's not outside. I said, wait, whoa, whoa. But I came out and all I found was this clip. This was missing and this has to actually be physically taken off. So when this was gone, I knew that somebody took him off and, and left with him. So the first thing that I did was I called the police and that's how I met Officer Michael Samp here. And people would come out and everybody was saying, where's Buddy, where's Buddy? And I said, somebody stole him. He's gone, somebody took him. They're like, oh my God. So it immediately, they all went on their social media. It went viral instantly, thousands of hits. Uh, it just was this massive wave. Michael Sampier showed up, who's an amazing guy, just a canine cop who just lost his canine. And he took an immediate interest. We called the shelters. Shelters didn't know anything, but they said, we'll work on it. So it was just like this massive wave that went outward. Phil got in on it. We surveilled the tapes. Phil just went deeper into the tapes. And she was waiting for everybody to disappear and she drove up here, lured Buddy to the car with treats, and then literally, witnesses said she hauled him into the car, and he was not having it. He didn't uh, get aggressive or anything, but she forced him into the car and took off. So Phil surveilled the tape, stayed three hours on his own time in here, and zeroed her. He found her in the store, shopping, and then followed her with the cameras to the checkout aisle that she used and found her address through the uh, Weiss card that she used to check out her groceries. So we found the house uh, through uh, Stroud Regional, collaborated with Penn Estates and at Penn Estates Security, found the house, we found Buddy. So now we're looking at this Shall place, it's the uh, Southernmost Homeless Assistance League and Street Defeat guide in this. It, it just raised the tension here uh, about what our situation is. So this abduction, uh, which was over in eight hours, turned into uh, a miracle. A, a wave of attention has come to us, a wave of assistance has come to us, and uh, we got a goal now. So I'm going to go to Shao, I'm going to get work, get my balance back, uh, we're going to get a home, and then my goal is to move to the islands and go back to doing what I'm doing. I'd like to buy a sailboat and live on it. That's, that's about, been a dream of mine, so I'm going to try to fulfill that dream. Yeah, we're going to Key West, right? Going to Key West, and back to the sea. He loves the sea. He, uh, I rescued him in Key Largo, so he's missing the sea as much as I am. And uh, we haven't been wet in a long time, have we, buddy? We're both marine mammals, and uh, we miss it so much. <laughs>